So what do we got going on here? Normally I would buy the rice from a Chinese place, but coronavirus, everyone is closed. So I need cold rice, so I have to make my own rice. Always pay somebody to make rice. Stimulate the economy. Thank you. Sake, butter, soy sauce, oil, shallots, broccoli, carrots, ribeye steaks, lemon juice, teriyaki sauce, sriracha, and garlic. It was brought to my attention today that what I've been making in my home is not bhaji. It's something called stir fry. Fuck. We're gonna make stir fry home bocce. Oh. <clears throat> We're gonna start. All right, so this shit is 50%. A big part of making this is doing your prep. You really gotta have everything out in front of you because it's, you make it really fast and there's a lot involved. Gordon Ramsay said Walmart has the best steaks. They really don't fucking look that good. I just went to an actual fucking butcher. I got some really nice ribeye steaks. First things first, I gotta cut up some shallots. I trust those who have come before me have showed me the way. I really wanna dice them up small. God damn. We're having a good time. Fry up an egg in a separate pan. So we're gonna get this little guy rolling up here at a medium heat. Slick my pan a little bit here. Can't have any accidents. I don't wanna do that ever again. Crack the yolk on that egg and get it all in there. These are gonna just get added into the fried rice. All right, I'm gonna take a tablespoon of butter. I'm gonna put that in my big skillet pan here. It's been heating up. Turn that heat right back up. Put our veggies in there. Sweet! I'm gonna bring in some cold white rice. I'm gonna get some garlic in there. I'm gonna bring our egg in there. I'm gonna add some sake. Stir that all around. We're just gonna put a little soy sauce on it actually and then that should cap the story for the rice. You don't wanna put too much because these mistakes are irreversible, friends. Can always add more. Now we're like almost at high heat here, but you're constantly stirring. Before your rice gets pasty, make sure all that sauce is in there. If you like the color, you're happy with it, shut it off, that's it. You don't want it to burn. We'll get back to that in a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna part out my broccoli. Ooh. So I'm gonna turn my pan on because I want that shit hot. I just want the crowns, I want the florets, I don't really want any of the other bullshit. So these broccolis here are beautiful. Another tablespoon salted butter. I'm gonna add some garlic. I'm gonna get the butter and the garlic all just nice and buttered garlic. Shredded carrots here. Make sure my ratios are on point. I'm gonna cut up a little bit more broccoli. So we're gonna go ahead and add a little bit of vegetable oil. Let me get everything nice and slick. We're gonna add a little bit of sake in here, just a tad. I'm gonna add my teriyaki sauce, put a little more garlic and butter, a little more sake. But you wanna put the teriyaki sauce at the end because it'll burn and stick to the pan and that is the worst, worse than cooking rice. Garlic, sake, teriyaki. This is the time that shit gets serious because this is the finale. I'm doing the steak now. I'm doing most of this in one pan. These are some super stunning, brilliant ribeye steaks. I'm gonna sear them on both sides for two minutes, come back, slice them, put them back in the pan for one minute, put the sauce and everything. <laughs> All right. You want your pan at a medium high heat, more towards the medium side. But we brought it way up for the vegetables. So don't forget to bring it back down for the meat. Half a tablespoon. Oh, you ready? So this is a fat steak. It might end up being more like three minutes on each side. So we're gonna flip it. About 30 seconds left on the steak. I'm gonna take it out, I'm gonna slice it up. I'm gonna put it back in the pan for about a minute because it's gonna be undercooked. Yeah. Trying to make nice bite-sized pieces of steak. All right, so we're gonna get a little more butter and garlic in there, boom. And I'm gonna pick these pieces nice and even. Heat's going back up. Sake's on. Soy. Oh, yeah. Now that steak is looking like a nice medium rare. We can get it out. Plate of vegetables. And there, my friends, you have the stir-fry home bocce dinner. Oh, wait. 
There is one final thing that makes this meal complete, and it is the side of sauce that my beautiful friend Jack taught me how to make. So we're gonna start with a little salted butter because we've used it in literally fucking everything. Get a little garlic, sake, teriyaki, and sriracha. Time is of the essence, child. Thanks so much again for tuning in to my episodes of Making Food. They make me really happy. Special thanks to Mark Damati and Mark Darch for always filming and editing these wonderful episodes. But let me tell you something, it's pretty good. My sauce here, wow. Thank you so much for being a part of the experience. See you next time.